Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to be getting thousands and thousands of units per month. Um, so recently, the Cyber Weekend offers came out, and people thought they weren't that good. Um, for me, I got good stuff, so I'm happy. But people were like, I get what people are saying. Why would you spend like 15, 18 thousand units on this? But the more I thought about it, it's pretty easy to farm that amount of units. Like by me not getting the offer, I'm just kind of losing. Even if it's not like the greatest offer in the world, it's still worth picking up. Because getting 15,000 units is a lot easier nowadays um, than it used to be. So I'm fine. Also, I've done all the content in the game. So I was trying to think like uh, how to get units basically. And so I'm just going to show you all the ways to get units. Um, so first, let's start off with just the events. Um, the solo and uh, the solo and alliance events. So every three days, you're gonna have a, a um, like twice a week, you're gonna have a three day event um, for your alliance. And if you get the max peak rewards, if you're in a good alliance, you should pretty much always get them. Twenty five units. You can get that twice a week, pretty much. Then you go to the solo event, and there's pretty much always a twenty two hour event going on. Once again, you do that. And this milestone, the fourth one, it's not that hard to get normally. You can get 25 more units. That's pretty much every day, so seven days a week, 175. It could be five to seven days a week. I don't know if it's all seven. I think it is, but I could be wrong. Either way, it won't make that much of a difference. So those are the you just events, pretty quick and easy. Then we got the arenas. This is pretty much going to be your main source of units, but this two-star arena, or the Summoner Trials arena, you can do this twice a week. 65 units from all the milestones three-star arena twice a week 65 units from all the milestones and then the four-star basic four-star featured and five-star arena if you get all the milestones it's 130 each um, and you can do it twice a week so you do all so once a week basically you should begin if you do all of these you'll be getting around 1295 units in a month or in a week i mean but then in a month you'll get uh, times four, obviously, because it's four weeks in a month. Uh, well, 5,180 units per month. So you do all that, you're getting over 5K units a month already. That's just the tip of the iceberg, but still the majority. Then you go to um, your event quest, and I don't know why it's not like this for Cavalier, but uh, for some reason, there's no units in Cavalier, but every other difficulty... From normal all the way to uncollected, so normal, heroic, master, uncollected, all of them within the quest, like master and uncollected, um, are in just completion and exploration rewards, but heroic and normal are in like the actual quest itself rewards. Um, I don't know why, but it's still the same. All four of them, okay, are 150 units if you fully explore them. So that's 600 units basically a month plus the monthly login calendar. I'm Thronebreaker, I don't know if it's different for you guys, but for me, I get 100 units a month from the 10, 20, 30, and 40. So basically, just from that stuff alone, the event quest and the calendars, you're getting an extra 700 units per month. So at this point, we're at 5,880 units per month. Next, the arena crystals, obviously, from the battle chips you're gonna get. If you do all this grinding, you're probably gonna get anywhere from 1 million or maybe higher depending on how you should get maybe a minimum uh, minimum of a million or more a month okay uh probably two million is the cap unless you're a crazy arena grinder uh, but you definitely can get a million a month not that hard by just doing all the arena milestones and stuff so and a million battle chips is around average two thousand units obviously you can get a lot more or a lot less based on rng but the average is two thousand units so you're going to be getting anywhere from 2,000 to 4,000 units a month um, by how much arena you grind. Obviously, this number can change based on your luck. So we're adding this. You can get anywhere from, with the battle tips, you can get anywhere from um, um, around 8,000 to 10,000 units a month. So that's just crazy. Just from like doing arena and the event quest and getting the battle chips. Next, uh, we're going to go over a variable that you shouldn't really rely on, but it can happen. Like next month, for example. We get a new variant, okay, and new uh, act content. This recent variant, I did the math. Um, from the variant difficulty, all of them together from the quest, you get 360 units, and then the classic difficulty, you get 150 units. So that together is 510 units. 
And then the new story chapter, if you look, um, we're getting 7.1, for example, next month. 6.4 had, from all the quests together, 6.4 is equal to 540 units. And Act 7.1 is probably going to be more. So minimum 540 units from next month from just the story quest. Unless they really screw us over and give us less units. Which I can't see I'm really doing, but I don't know. Um, so with that being said, as long as they don't change the values lower, we're going to give it at least 1,050 units next month from the variant classic difficulties, from the new variant, and from the new piece of story content. So... With all this being calculated, uh, we're going to go over to a Google Sheets. So I'll be right back. Showing this now in um, Google Sheets format. You can see all this stuff. Um, so from everything combined, you're going to be getting around, if you do everything, you're going to be getting probably 7,500 on the low end if you do everything to about 11,000 units per month based on how lucky you are, based on how much arena you're going to. And adding this, which is not normally going to be a factor. So it's normally going to be around this number down here, um, around like 7,800 to like 10,000 units, around that area. It just really depends on if you do everything. But basically a month, if you grind a crap ton of arena, okay, and you get you get decently lucky, you don't get screwed over too hard, you do all the arenas, do all the events, you're going to be getting around 10,000 units a month. And if you times that by 12 for a year, you're going to be getting... 120,000 units a year. So 120,000 units a year, that's crazy. Um, obviously, it's a lot of grinding. You basically have to sell your soul um, to this game with all the arena grinding you're going to do. But if you really need um, units, okay, and a lot of people play this game are kids, so they don't have like, jobs and shit yet, uh, you can do this. Um, obviously, newer accounts can't get all the milestones for every arena, but... Um, if you can, you can be getting anywhere from 10,000 units a month or more if you like go crazy with the arena. Most of your, most of your units are going to come from the arena. You don't have to really do the 22-hour um, events. Some of them happen naturally, like hero use and stuff. The three-day alliance events, you just pretty much need to be in alliance to get those guaranteed. Uh, for me, I only do these three arenas. Um, the four-star basic, four-star feature, and a five-star arena. I don't do the two- and three-star, but if you want an extra... Um, what is this? An extra um, 270 units a week. You could do that too. But for me, I just don't. I also don't explore um, Heroic and Normal. I'll explore um, Cavalier and Collected and Master. Once again, I don't know why Cavalier doesn't have units, but whatever. And um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, if you work your ass off and sell your soul, you can be getting 10,000 units a month. So people ask me why I bought the Cyber Weekend offers, because if I grind like I normally do, should get my units back in two, three months. Uh, plenty of time for the 4th of July offers to come. And yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video, go like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.